Last time on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. The androids were set free and they were on their way to search for Goku and destroy him. Plus Krillin was a simp. Bulma then explained to Trunks that there was a future time machine that has been there for three years. And the culprit was none other than Cell. He learned that when he absorbs Android 17 and Android 18, he will achieve his perfect form. But the Sea Fighters will stop at nothing to keep him from doing so. Will Cell actually achieve his perfect form? Find out in this episode. What is up, my homies? It's your boy, the John, and welcome back for more Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. And pretty much, I'm not gonna do say what's going on, so let's go ahead and get so we'll get on with the let's play here. Now, I'm trying to get used to this particular let's play where I don't say what happened last time because I'm trying to keep I'm trying to keep going with the whole narrator thing before it gets to the actual video. You know what I mean? Because it's supposed to be for the let's play itself. So anyway, let's continue on with the story. Waste no time. I think this is it. Yeah. So, should we just go ahead and blow it up? Not yet. We should head down there and see what we can find first. We might be able to discover something about how to defeat the androids. Ah, right. Then let's make our way inside. Okay. Sorry, I had something... I was picking my teeth while I was doing this. Sorry about that. Did it. Right. Now, Cell won't be a problem in this timeline. And now, we got an ace up our sleeve. Good call saying we should dig around the lab. I didn't think we'd actually be able to find the blueprints for Androids 17 and 18. If we show these to my mother, she should be able to figure out how we can defeat them. True. Actually, would you mind taking this to my mother for me? I have something I need to do. Huh? You're not coming? No. I thought I'd do some training with my father. If he's able to go beyond Super Saiyan, then I should too with Pro- Well, Vegeta's not exactly a team player. He probably won't want to train with you. You may be right. But sparring with someone leads to greater results in a short amount of time. Even my father should know that. It's worth a shot, at least. Right. Sounds like you know what you're doing. Reading you loud and clear. Good luck! Thanks. Then, Trunks sought out his father, Vegeta, while Krillin made his way to Bulma to deliver the blueprints. The blueprints aren't even blue. Impressed and terrified by Dr. Jiro's genius, Bulma searched for the android's weakness. First two, and then three days had passed. Piccolo and the others, using Kame House as their base, continued their hunt for Cell, but to no avail. They could do nothing but watch as news of more victims spread. A monster has made its way to a town in South District 48. Half the residents are gone. Hmm. So he's made his way south. Well, come on! We might still be able to catch him if we leave now. Good luck! That cell creep sure is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, did everyone leave? Go on too? Great so. Go on. Please be careful. I hope they're able to find that monster. <sighs> huh? Goku! Goku's back in the house! Hey! Are you feeling better? Yeah, I'm all better now. Finally. Oh, thank goodness! Sorry to worry you, Chi Chi. And you too, Master Roshi. Ah, we're just glad you're better. By the way. It looks like everyone left. Are they after that cell guy? Uh, yeah. But how did you know about him? I heard everyone talking while I was asleep. I think I got the gist of what's going on. Oh. I think I've got a train, too. You're going to fight? No way! You're in no shape to fight! You need more rest! 
Chichi, shut up! Relax, guys. I'm not gonna fight anyone just yet. I mean, if Vegeta can't handle him, then there's no way I can. I'm gonna have to train and reach even higher levels. Higher than even Super Saiyan. Uh, a level even higher than Super Saiyan? Chichi, I, I want to take Gohan with me when I'm training. Is that okay with you? You're kidding, right? Oh, I guess there's nothing I can do to stop you if I say no. Fine. If you're going to train him, then make him strong. Thanks, Chi-Chi. But once the fight's over, it's straight back to his studies and nothing else, no matter what. And you're going to get a job. The audacity of this. You got it. Thank you. All right. Time to go. Finally. Oh my. Sorry, I'm in the middle of cutting right now. Okay, sorry, I'm back. I had to see what my mom wanted. She's been constantly calling me. She came in my room Where earlier. do you think Vegeta and Trunks are training? Let's see. I'm picking up some energy way over there. I'm guessing it might be them. Goku! So, how's your training going? Not very well. My father's treating me like an obstacle rather than a training partner. He's been like that for three days now. Just standing there. Oh. Oh, I know what was I know what's going on. That that one scene that everybody likes to use when it comes to Vegeta. I know I know that scene. That's Vegeta for you. If I had to guess, I'd say he's probably thinking about how to go beyond Super Saiyan. Don't bother me, Kakarot. Get lost. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. I know a great place to train. It's called the Hyperbolic Time Chamber. You can get a year's worth of training there in just one day. It's up at Kami's Lookout. Are you serious? Seriously, come with us. You don't have to train with me or anything if you don't want to. Just so you know, two people can use the room at once. So to save time, you're gonna have to go in with trunks. Fine, but we're going in first. Sure. I don't know if I mentioned this already, but the DLCs, I'm not gonna do. Father. The other game constantly interrupted me. Um, I'm not going to um, record like video. I'm not gonna like make edits of like me doing the let's play of me doing the um, the DLCs. I think what I'm gonna do is just live stream it. Just live stream them. At least the ones that I have available. I don't think I don't have the one where Trunks was younger and Gohan was like older and then he had one arm. I don't have that one, and I don't have one with like with, I think I have I do I probably have the one with Bardock. I'm not sure, and I don't have the one with um Kid Goku either. I don't think it kept it comes with an update, but I'm not sure. I'll see I'll see when I get to it. Matter of fact, I'll look at it now. Let's see what DLCs I have, what DLCs I don't have. Yeah, of course it's been added. So yeah, see, yeah. These are DLCs I have. I have Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Blue, and Future Gohan and Young Tr Future Trunks. And we got Bar then we got Bardock, and then we got uh, what's his face? Goku, like the the tournament thing. So these so these will be so these are like. These three, these three, these two right here, I I probably have to buy. But these three, I could probably just live stream because I am not trying to record the, those videos again. No, no, I would, I do not want to do that again. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna have to live stream these. And yeah, and of course, I'm gonna be the last person to do these, so it don't really matter. So we'd like to train in the hyperbolic time chamber. Is that okay with you? Very well. This way. The room comes equipped with a bath, toilet, bed, and food. Good luck to you. Are you sure you want me to train harder, Kakarot? My end goal is to take you out after all. It's probably gonna take more than one of us to take this enemy down. Go forward knowing that, okay? In the future, you may very well regret this. If it's okay, we'll head in first. Good luck, guys! And play nice! Please do. But knowing Vegeta, he plays rough. What do you mean by that? I mean, he did do it with Bulma, so... Huh? Yeah, I'm just gonna shut up now. It's 
so hot. It's kind of hard to breathe, and the increased gravity makes it hard to move. And there's nothing here. It's just empty white space. Good. This is all I need. I... I have to spend a year in here with my father? Hey, you did want to train with me, didn't you? Then let's see what I'm dealing with. Show me what you've got. Huh? Right. So who am I playing as? Come at me full force. Don't hold back. Okay. Here I go. This is you at your best. Don't make me laugh. Big bang. Believe it. Dang, bro. Dang, drunk. Okay, okay. Alright, here we go. A waste of my time. Wait, that's it? That's literally it? Is this really your power? I better not find out you're going easy on me just because I'm your father. No, it's not that. It's just... No matter who your opponent is, you come at them as if you intend to kill them, understand? You are a member of the proud warrior race of Saiyans. And on top of that, royal blood runs through your veins. My blood! I... I'm... not like you, father. <laughs> you coward. You're about to learn that nothing stands in my way. Oh, goody. It looks like I found my next meal. I'm coming for you, Android 17 and 18. Once I gather enough energy from these filthy humans, I will absorb the both of you. <laughs> and then I will finally become the ultimate life form. <laughs> Shout out the Hedgehog much? Soon I will be complete. <laughs> <laughs> Almost a full day had passed since Vegeta and Trunks had entered the hyperbolic time chamber. The world is gripped with fear as the death toll has now reached several hundreds of thousands. There's no way that we're gonna find him. There's too many places for him to hide, you know? We're running out of time. Cell's powered himself up quite a bit already. Well, we might have to rely on Goku and the others for this. Let's just hope they can go beyond Super Saiyan. Hmm? What? Hey. Cell's fearsome evolution. Oh, here we go. Damn it. Why did it have to be now? So, is Goku here? He wasn't back at his place. So, we thought he might be hiding here. Just beat it, would you? You're not going to find Goku here. Oh, then tell us where we can find him. Do you honestly think we're just going to tell you? Your choice. You can either tell us, or we can make you. Fine by me. There's a deserted island not too far from here. We'll settle it there. Man, you guys aren't making this easy on yourselves. Sorry, but you're going to stay right here. You'd only be getting in the way. What, got nothing to say? I'll just have to kill you then. Fine. <laughs> this isn't going to be as easy as you think. Well, come at me already. What, you're the only one that's gonna fight? Of course. Why not? I'm more than enough to handle you. This could work. If I can scrap even just Android 17, Cell won't get his perfect body. Let's go! Unleash your inner power, You're no Andrew. Looks like you're pretty powerful. Okay, that's not gonna work. He's got to bury you out. Now for the 
Okay, back up, back up. Power up. He just got stand there? Okay, he's powering up at least. Okay, he's got bearer up. Won't do anything until... Wait for it. No! Oh, he blew it up again. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Wait for it. No! That's not as you look, huh? Okay, with the mind pretty good. But not good enough. <laughs> what are you? What? Are you, I, I can hear you in there. Let's just continue. We might be evenly matched in power, but when it comes to stamina, you've lost. I've got infinite energy reserves, after all. Cell. <laughs> of course. Damn it. I was so focused on the fight, I didn't realize he was on his way here. I'm so pleased that this day has finally come. Look at the angle in his face. That makes him look more menacing. It's like you can't even see his eyes, like his pupils. The day I absorb Android 17 and 18 will be the day I achieve my ultimate form. Well, at least you didn't say ultimate life form again. You're not Shadow the Hedgehog, pal. I know I said that joke already, but what? still. You powered yourself up this much? Damn it. Just how many victims have you gone through? Victims? That is such a short-sighted perspective. I prefer to call them donors. They're the ones I have to thank for my power, after all. <laughs> donors? Seriously? Get out of here right now! He's going to absorb you, Seventeen! What? Absorb me? What are you talking about? I'll make it simple. That there is Cell. A monster that was created by Dr. Giroux's computer. But apparently is incomplete and needs to absorb you in 18 to achieve his final form. What? Rejoice, my fellow androids. Once I have absorbed you, your energy will feed my rise to true perfection. I will finally evolve into what Dr. Giroux spent his life trying to achieve, the ultimate warrior. What are you talking about? You're looking at the ultimate warrior right here. Stop the cap. <laughs> Boy, if you don't sit down as well. Whether you desire it or not is irrelevant. You will be absorbed all the same. Having trouble shutting that mouth? Here, let me help. No! Get out of here, 17! The enemy's power level far exceeds your own. <laughs> Jeez. You finally start talking. And you're just telling me to run away? Give me a break! Damn it! Now they both gotta fight him. Hello, Krillin? I figured it out! I know how to take the androids down! W really Yeah! Androids 17 and 18 are equipped with emergency shutdown circuits. If you can activate those to immobilize them, they'll be sitting ducks! And I've already made a remote control that can do that! Ah, uh, thanks, Bulma! Can you bring that thing here? One step ahead of you! I'm already on my way and I'll be there soon! Awesome! You're the best! I'm going to go help Piccolo. I might not be able to do much, but it's better than doing nothing here. Uh, no, Tien! Wait! Come back! There's nothing I can do. I feel so powerless. Cause you's an old man. What do you expect? I sure do miss the days of being the world's greatest martial artist. Didn't wish to be younger or something. I don't know. You should have been done that. This freak's more powerful than I thought. You bore me. Are we done playing around? Get... Take this! Get out of here, Seventeen! Ah! 
He did that with just one attack? I can't believe it. He's just too powerful. There's nothing I can do. It's hopeless. Maybe. Maybe we should try to get out of here while we can. You should leave. I will stay and destroy Cell. Stay behind and destroy Cell? Are you crazy? He'll kill you in an instant. You are good people. You did not harm innocent humans or animals. I have enjoyed our time together. Hmm. I guess androids do have hearts. It's time to feast. Ugh. You picked the wrong house, fool! Boy! <laughs> <laughs> Donk. That was an OP move, and he should have went down just like that. So, 16 was hiding this kind of power all along. No! You must leave this place. Hurry, he is still alive. You're joking, right? I'm not just gonna run away without giving that monster his just desserts. If anyone's gonna finish you off, it's me. Come on, show yourself. D Looking for me? Here I am. No. No. Big mistake. Ah, that look gross. Oh, we're not there yet, guys. Hold your horses. Run, 18! This is bad. I'm sorry, Chatsu. I might not survive this. You're a fool if you think I'm just going to let you get away. My speed is even more impressive than I thought was possible, and I have Android 17 to thank for it. He wasn't a waste after all. Am now, I allowed? Oh. let's check my power, shall we? Am I allowed to be offended by his lips? But I feel because I feel very offended 16! by his lips. Don't worry, Android 18. I haven't forgotten about you. It's time to create perfection. Hmm. Neo Tri Beam. Ha! <laughs> what are you doing? Get out of here! Ha! Ha! Twelve seconds later. <sighs> Fools! I will not be stopped by a weak, pathetic fool like Tien! Goku. So you're Cell! Wait! That energy! Piccolo's still alive! I don't know what you're doing here. But I'm not letting you get away. This guy's got some serious energy. Right, let's see. Let's see how we handle. Lend me your energy. Oh, I got. I got that move. Can you stay still? After all that, he still hasn't broken a sweat. What? Am I more than you bargained for? Whoa! 
Oh, dang. No, no. Come on, come on. Oh, oh. Get oh, away from me. Let me. Oh, great. I'm not a super insane anymore. Thanks. Okay, transform now. You know what? Screw it. Get on my nerves, though. Focus. I need to get Tien and Piccolo out of here right now. Okay. Oh my goodness. Where, where, where did he go? Huh? How did he move that fast? There's no way around it. I'm no match for you. I know that. But, give me just one day. Do it, and I'll give you a good fight. I promise you that. <laughs> You've got to be joking. What do you think that you could possibly accomplish in just one day? you got to hang in there for me, you two. I'll get you guys some sensu beans once we're back at Kami's lookout. Leaving so soon? I don't think... Do fast think he's gone? That's an interesting technique Goku was using. When did he learn that, I wonder? No matter. As soon as I get my hands on Android 18, he will be of no concern. Now that pile of scrap 16 and her couldn't have gotten very far. Cell has reached untouchable levels of power. Nothing can stop him now. Hey! Everyone! Vegeta and Trunks are coming out of the hyperbolic time chamber! Really? Hey, everyone. Sorry for the wait. My father broke through the Super Saiyan barrier in about two months. But he still wouldn't... Trunks, that's enough now. Sounds like you did it, Vegeta. You could say that. You can go in next if you want to. But it would only be a waste of your time. I'm more than enough to clean up this mess. Cell and the androids don't stand a chance. Oh my god, do you ever shut up? Well, I went down and fought Cell myself. He's super strong now, a real monster. <laughs> there you are! Krillin said you'd all be here. Huh? Wait, what's going on here? Trunks, is that you? Uh, yes. What's with your hair? Are you wearing a wig or something? There's... There's this room here where one year passes inside while just one day passes out here. Father and I were training in there. Oh. What the hell are you doing here, Bulma? Here. Vegeta's battle suit has great defensive properties. So... I made some for everyone. Whoa! This stuff's a lot lighter than it looks. Did you not hear me, Kakarot? Your services aren't required. Do you ever shut up, Vegeta? My god. Because you're gonna beat Cell, right? I heard ya. That's fine by me. All right, Gohan. Time for some quality father-son training. Right! I like how we're. I like how I'm playing as Gohan and not as Goku, because this is supposed to be Goku's game we're talking about. <laughs> Training to surpass Super Saiyan. Wow, it's nothing but white space. My body feels heavy, and it's so hot I can barely breathe. That's not all. This place is as big as the Earth itself. Get lost out there and you're a goner. Be careful. So, we're gonna spend a year in here? Let's get right into it. After all, it's not like we're here on vacation. First things first, we're gonna make you a Super Saiyan. Me? A, a Super Saiyan? I don't know if I have what it takes. 
Come on, you have your dad's blood. You can do this. Of course you do. Don't forget that you got Saiyan blood running through your whole body. See, even he thinks so. He's your dad after all. All that said, any real type of training we need to do isn't gonna happen until you're a Super Saiyan. Aren't I just gonna waste your time and, and get in your way? Hey, your father is nothing like Vegeta. He's different. Well, yeah, at first. Okay, never mind. But don't get me wrong. I'm planning on going completely beyond Super Saiyan when the time is right. I've got plans for you too. I want you to get even stronger than that. I know you can do it. Just don't screw it up when you start learning your studies and all that junk. What? Me? Stronger than you? Yep. If anyone can do that, it's you. Yeah, not Vegeta. Freaking loser. Oh! Man. I. I hope I can. We know you can. Foreshadowing! <laughs> Relax! It's gonna take some time, so no rush. We'll take it nice and slow at first. Now that's enough talking. Let's get warmed up. This may be just a warm up, but don't go easy on it, okay? Okay. Strong, Gohan. You still got more in you. Not done yet. There you go, Gohan. That's the stuff. Okay. What the? Okay. Hold on. Heating up. Uh, that means you're getting there. You're getting stronger. <sighs> it's really hard to fight in a place like this. It is. But your techniques and movements are pretty great. I'm betting you've got Piccolo to thank for all that. <laughs> Guess that means we can move straight on to Super Saiyan training. What do you say? Y yeah. No, no, no. All you're doing is raising your energy. That's not enough. You need to get angry to become a Super Saiyan. Get angry! Let out all your rage! I'm... I'm trying. I can't get angry, though. It's not gonna come to you right away, and that's okay. Me and Vegeta had to go through a lot before we got it. There's no need to rush, Gohan. R right. All right. Time to go. I'm coming, too. Very well. Hmm. I don't see 18 anywhere. She's got to be hiding somewhere on one of these islands. Very well. Listen up, 18. You better make your presence known. If you don't, I'm going to start destroying these islands one at a time until I find you. She won't come out. She's not making this easy. You, you're Vegeta. So you're Cell. That's Vegeta. 
And what is it that you think you're doing here? Don't tell me you think you can stop me! I didn't come here to stop you. I came here to tear you limb from limb! Tear me limb from limb, you? <laughs> That's hilarious! Oh, but I'm getting so tired of hearing you talk. I know, right? <laughs> Take what? a good I agree long with look, Cell. I'm going to beat that stupid grin right off that annoying face of yours. <laughs> oh, we gotta play the theme again? Alright, might as well. for you to handle now, aren't I? <laughs> How is this happening? You're Vegeta, right? I mean, Vegeta? Wrong. I am Super Vegeta! Oh, that power level is huge! Uh, amazing! So that's the new and improved Vegeta, huh? So, is Trunks that strong too? I don't see Goku or Gohan anywhere. Uh, it's the androids! They were here the whole time? Cell, Vegeta, Trunks, they don't know they're here, do they? I've got to be within 10 yards of them for the remote control to work. Here goes nothing. You've used up all your power and still you couldn't muster the strength to fight me. Very disappointing. Oh, this can't be... <laughs> this can't be happening! If, if I could only gain the energy I need to fight you with my perfect body! What's that? You actually think getting that perfect body of yours would be enough to defeat me? <laughs> of course! I wouldn't lose to the likes of you! <sighs> okay. Uh, now... I should be within ten yards of them. Uh, I gotta make sure I shut 18 down, then destroy her. Otherwise, Cell's going to absorb her. This is my only shot. Better make it count. See ya. He's not gonna do it. He's not gonna do it. I know it. Knowing Krillin, he ain't gonna do it. Huh? You! Uh, uh, that's an emergency shutdown remote control! Why does he have that? Uh, sorry, Bulba! Huh? Yep, what'd I tell you? Go on, get out of here while you still can! Avoid Cell and live your life! Why did you... why did you destroy that? That was your only chance! It's... Uh... If I could achieve my perfect form, power, speed, technique, intelligence, I would be perfect in every way. The computer told me as much. Is this true? Could achieving this perfect form of yours actually close the gap between us? How many times are you gonna make me repeat myself? You... you would have no hope of defeating me. At least not as you are right now. Hmm... Uh, father... 
Don't tell me you're... You say and say your warriors through and through. I would think you'd want to at least test your metal against my perfect form. Fine. I'll fall for your little ruse. Go ahead and get this perfect form you've been babbling on about. Go on! Father! <laughs> My father may be willing to let you go, but I'm not! Hey, Vegeta! Do something about this guy, would ya? Huh? This is 18. So she was hiding there the whole time. He's going to. What? Vegeta, you idiot! You. <laughs> I'm so close to perfection, I can taste it. Father, what you're doing is wrong. We can't let him absorb 18. <laughs> Where's your sense of pride? Don't you want to see how much stronger he can get? Uh, no. I've seen enough bloodshed and destruction in my future. Solar flare! Ah! 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 <laughs> my eyes! Uh! Uh! Ah! No! Stop! Uh, Eighteen. Uh, uh! No! We're finally going to see this perfection of his. It better not disappoint, that's for sure. Uh, you're digging your own grave, Vegeta. No. He's... Cell had finally absorbed Android 18 and achieved his perfect form. Thanks to Vegeta, freaking idiot. In a fit of rage, Krillin launched himself at Cell, but was effortlessly sidelined by Cell's newfound strength. Krillin, having been brought back from the brink of death thanks to a Senzu bean from Trunks, was overwhelmed by the power of Cell's perfect form. Vegeta, excited by the prospect of fighting a more worthy opponent, taunted Cell into continuing their fight. Cell calmly accepted Vegeta's challenge and prepared to engage him in battle once Achieving perfection. <sighs> Vegeta, I hate you so much for this. <laughs> Would you care to take part in a little warm-up? See, Vegeta, this is exactly why Goku and literally everyone else, including Gohan, is better than you. Matter of fact, this is gonna sound stupid. This is gonna sound stupid. Even Yamcha is better than you. Sure, he's maybe selfish, but not as selfish as you. My God. Oh man. Just... Okay. To all the things I said about Chi Chi and Boma, I take it all back. Vegeta's gotta be the most annoying character in the Dragon Ball franchise. I mean, there are times he's changed, but here it's just. Oh man. Uh, okay, let's just let's just continue. Sure, a warm up you won't survive. We'll see about that. From the looks of it, this perfect form of yours doesn't seem like it was worth the wait. Is that so? Not giving it everything you've got, are you? You do know what the word warm up means, don't you? Well, Vegeta, he doesn't care. Ha! 
Fight me already! Well then, let's fight. <laughs> so this is Super Vegeta, is Oh, he's... <laughs> Try some of this! He's coming on me all just like, did like a little... Did you see that? It did like a little homing beacon on me. Well, you're finished. Well, now look at this. Hmm, that's so odd. It appears this gap between us you mentioned is moving in the opposite direction now. Why would that be? Oh, <laughs> whatever. I think it's about time to kill you. What are you doing, Trunks? If you don't get in there, Vegeta's gonna die! My father would rather be defeated by Cell than have me, Goku, or anyone help him. He's that proud of a warrior. Hey, I, I get that, but still! Just let him, just let him get himself, just let him get his junk wreck, bro. Just let him, let him cry like a little baby like how he did when he like how Frieza killed him just let it happen I really don't care if my father loses consciousness while fighting cell I'll step in <laughs> impressive it looks like you're still holding on to what little life you got left allow me to put you out of your misery Vegeta Trunks. I'm gonna kill you, Cell. Quite a gutsy thing to say, Trunks. Krillin, take my father and get him out of here. Right, you got it. <laughs> Trunks' power level is taking a massive dive. Cell's power level is through the roof. Did he overpower Trunks? Uh, not good. Vegeta! Come on, Vegeta! Wake up! <sighs> but I'm rather disappointed in you and Vegeta. I expected more from you two. I mean, don't tell me this has been a waste of my time. Now, just one last question. It's interesting. Although it ultimately proved meaningless, you were able to greatly increase your power in a very short period of time. If you had more time, would you be able to power up even further? It's hard to say without actually trying. Why would you ask me something like that? <laughs> so it is a possibility. Next question. Why hasn't Goku shown his face yet? I mean, what could he possibly be doing that's more important than this? Goku is training to take you down. No matter what you do, he'll be ready to fight you tomorrow. I like how he's saying that with the hair covering his face. <laughs> I find that funny for some reason. I don't know why. If you're looking for a real challenge, and it sounds like you are, then Goku won't disappoint. Trust me. Can y'all like pan the camera to like the to the right and then rotate it slightly to his face? Glad to hear it. Then maybe I'll hold a little tournament. A, a tournament? Let's make it mm, 10 days from now. Say 12 o'clock, that should give you time to better your skills if that's possible. No, what are you talking about? I don't know if you're aware of this or not, but there used to be a martial arts tournament known as the World Tournament. I think it's high time we brought that back. One small change, in this tournament I'll be the only opponent. I'll fight you one victim at a time. And if I win, the next challenger enters the arena and fights me. And then the next, and the next, until I'm the last one standing. Oh no, don't tell me. Don't tell me a certain person is going to show up. Don't tell me. I think I already know who it is. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't tell me he's going to show up and take all the credit. Because I already know where this is going. I'll spread the word of the tournament, its rules, and its location soon. Perhaps we can even have the whole thing televised. 
<laughs> what fun. Uh, wait, Cell! What's the point of holding a tournament? What's your end goal? The tournament will showcase my strength and true greatness. And plunging the world into terror will be a nice little bonus as well. And my end game is... I don't have one. I mean, maybe to have a little fun toying with you halfwits, destroying, tormenting, lording over you. But my real passion, of course, is to see the look on people's faces as they cower and realize that all hope is lost. Ah! So you're just gonna destroy the planet and that's it? Typical Dragon Ball villain. <laughs> I can't wait to see what you can do. It's oh, it's always the villain trying to conquer the world, or there's I mean the weaker ones usually try to conquer the world, but the most powerful would try to destroy the world and conquer the universe itself. And I'm just like, it's so unoriginal. Like every villain has that goal. Goku Black has it. Frieza has it. Pretty much every villain has that kind of goal. After reviving Vegeta and Krillin with some Senzu beans, Trunks told them about the tournament Cell was planning to hold. Uh, a tournament? He's just toying with us. Damn him! I... I plan on entering the hyperbolic time chamber again, once Goku and Gohan are out. You and Kakarot will only get in the way. I will be the one to enter that room and finish this. Uh-huh. Oh my god, Vegeta. I... I too will enter the tournament. Please, take me to the Capsule Corporation and have me repaired. I will prove useful. Are you crazy? You're one of Dr. Giro's androids! Okay, I'll take you. Truth be told, we could use as many allies as we can get. Krillin! Relax, Trunks. I have a feeling this guy's not so bad after all. I mean... The two other androids Cell absorbed didn't seem that bad either. You said it yourself. These androids and history itself are different from what you know. <laughs> there you go. Finally, somebody went Super Saiyan. Gohan, you've gotten so much stronger than I thought you would. It's pretty impressive. Go on, is it just me or did you get taller? I hope so. It's hard to tell though. But I gotta say, you haven't come close to reaching your full potential yet. You've got a lot more in you. I just know it. Really? What do you say? Think it's time to finish up our training? Finish it? Yep. Come at me with everything you've got. And don't hold back. Try your best to take your old man down, huh? I would use the Super Saiyan Gohan theme, but this isn't the right time to use it. So I'm gonna use it later on in this episode. You'll see, don't worry. Well, I can't do that, but I'll do what I can. I thought most of his hair doesn't Come go on, Gohan. Let's Super see what you've got. Gohan. Show me. Okay. Not too shabby, Gohan. Now it's my turn. Why are you using the dumb do it, Dane? See, I wanted you to do it earlier, but man, the game's just like... Why is every time I want to use the attack that I want to use? Yeah, but the way how the game does it is like... The way how the game does it is like you have to hold the button. I uh, hold the button and then actually press it, but half the time it doesn't want to work. This is great, Gohan. You're well on your way to surpassing me. Surpassing you? What are you doing, Gohan? You need to get angrier. I, I, I promise. If only someone close to him actually died right in front of him. Go 
Rock, rock, paper, scissors, nothing. There you go. Go on. Go on. That was incredible. Don't ever forget what that felt like. Right. Uh, but, Dad, we're probably gonna need more time before we go beyond Super Saiyan, don't you think? I mean, come on! I just learned how to become one, so I have no clue what I would even do to go further than that. Emotional damage. That's usually how it works for Saiyans. I think I just might know what to do about that. Huh? We just need to get our bodies used to staying in the Super Saiyan form. What do you say? Think the two of us can manage that, Gohan? Staying in the Super Saiyan form? Yep. We treat Super Saiyan as our normal state of being. Do you understand? Anytime we're awake and moving around, that's the form we'll be in. Oh, great. And then Chi Chi comes in. First, we'll learn to control the more emotional aspects of the transformation. That makes the most sense, right? Then, once we do that, we'll start our training up again from the basics. This could work out. I know it's not exactly straightforward, but I really think this is our best shot at going beyond Super Saiyan. Uh, uh, okay. After informing Trunks of the tournament, Cell constructed an arena in a nearby deserted area. He then forced his way into a TV station and, via live broadcast, delivered his terrifying message to the entire world. His tournament, known as the Cell Games, would be open to all and begin in just nine days. Cell then declared that if all participants were to fail, he would eliminate all known life on the planet. In order to prove that he meant business about his threat, he easily reduced a section of the city to rubble. Cell's ultimatum proved effective in its purpose as the world had become utterly gripped in fear. Recent peace had weakened army and police forces now powerless to confront the new enemy. People had already seemed to have forgotten about the young boy who had stopped the evil demon King Piccolo. Of course they forgot, because it's been so darn long. They were also unaware of Vegeta, the Saiyans, and the others that fought Frieza on Namek. Goku was no more than a long forgotten memory. Well, that's a shame. Damn that cell. This is just a game to him? No way. I can't believe he actually went on television and told everyone. If none of us can beat him, he's going to kill everyone on Earth. And now the whole world is panicking. I hope Goku and Gohan are almost done with their training. There are still three hours left before the full day is up. <laughs> no guarantee they'll come out after exactly one day. No need to rush. We've got nine days until the games. Huh? That's Goku and Gohan's energy. Are they out already? What? What are they... What are they doing out this early? What? Vegeta and Trunks? You guys are here too? Cell must still be alive. What happened? I can still sense his energy. Huh? That's Gohan. He looks so different. What? They're... They're still Super Saiyan? Wait, something is different. They seem calm. Someone get us up to speed on what's going on. Uh, right. Here's what happened. The Cell Games, huh? So, he's holding a tournament. Honestly, that sounds kind of fun. Mr. Popo, you still got my uniform? Oh, yes, I have it right here. Mr. Piccolo, I'd like some new clothes, too. Like yours. Okay, 
Close me! Sure oh, thing. Stuff. You're gonna look real good in this. Same as the original clothes. Yay! <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Piccolo. So, tell me, think you have what it takes to beat Cell? Not sure. I haven't had the pleasure of meeting him in this perfect form of his yet. Actually, I'll go do that now. Hmm. There we go. Oh, it's Goku. Yep, in the flesh. So what do you think, Goku? Are you willing to let the fate of your world be decided in this ring? Kind of small for something like that, wouldn't you say? <laughs> so that's your perfect form. Yes, yes indeed. You can count on me being here for the tournament. But until then, don't go killing anybody. Not one person, got it? We're gonna have a great match. Man, he's gotten way stronger than I thought he would. So, Goku, what do you think? I'll be completely honest. I didn't think he'd power up as much as he did. Okay, so... I won't know for sure until I fight him, but... I'm probably not gonna be strong enough to beat him. Uh, no way! Then just go back into the hyperbolic time chamber. We've got the time. Nah, me and Gohan will train outside. We got nine days. We'll figure something out within that time. But why? You still haven't used up a full day. Why in the world would you waste one of the two days of your life you're allowed inside that chamber? Because that place can really put your body through the ringer, if you know what I mean. We could use some quality rest right now. Well, well. Look at that. Even the mighty Kakarot wasn't nearly tough enough to handle the room. Shut up, Vegeta. Man. I wish I could just pimp slap you in the head right now and actually does something to you. I swear to God, but you need to shut up sometimes. Fine. You might be right about that. But training there anymore wouldn't do us any good. But don't let me stop you. If you guys want to head back inside, go right on ahead. Besides, it looks like you could use some more training. What? You have some nerve. You don't actually think you're stronger than me now, do you? Don't make me laugh! Yeah, a lot stronger, actually. What? All right. Keep at it, you guys. See you all at the tournament, okay? Gohan, let's go. Oh, right. Only nine days remained until the Cell Games tournament. Goku and Gohan returned home for some well-earned rest after their intense training. Here's the plan. We'll rest for three days, train for three days, and then rest another three. How does all that sound? Dad, uh, are you sure that's okay? You think we can beat Cell? Trust me, we'll be fine. Goku, I need you to come back to the house. Huh? Chi Chi? Oh boy, here we go. You know what? I don't want to hear Chi Chi's mouth. Especially at, the, at close to this end of the episode, so I can go ahead and just end this now. My brain already kind of hurts, so I might as well take a little rest after this. So technically, I already recorded the last part the same day I recorded this one. So I go ahead and just end this off here. Thank you so much for watching. Snap that like button and subscribe. Ignore the dislike button. Leave comment below. Check out. Take, uh, just think, uh, <laughs> I can't read English. Take a think of this video. This game. This entire let's play. Click on the notification bell, check out for more videos. If you can't wait for more, always check out my old ones. This is John and done now. Peace out, my homies. Alright. I think it's time I need to take a rest as well. Winners, 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 winners,